everyone, Ryan Ray here, Outpost 23. Thank you so much for tuning in. Question of the day, is the child the only one? Let me know in the comments below. If you like the video, like, subscribe, thumbs up, all that good stuff. Okay, let's get into it. Uh, on the recent Mandalorian, we learn that the child's blood, Yoda, baby Yoda's blood, has been used to try to promulgate a cloning program, you know, something, something along those lines. We're not getting get all the details, but the child, that's, we understand more about why they're wanting the child now. Um, Moth Gideon's behind it. So it left me wondering if, if that's the case and the experiment isn't working because the child is now in the Mandalorian's hand, does that mean that he is the, or she, whatever, uh, baby Yoda is the only one. Is the child the only one? In other words, does Moth Gideon have multiple secret labs spread out across the galaxy, and he's trying this out? Uh, is there other moths that have this same type of um, program going on that, you know, we're going to find out in a couple seasons maybe that another moth somewhere else has been running a similar experiment, uh, experiment with a different Force-sensitive being? I think they're setting us up for the child to not be the only one, but to be a, the significant one for now. Um, maybe I'm wrong, but I think that's where we're headed, is that we're going to find, maybe later this season, next season, that the child is just one of many, and ultimately, ultimately, there are others. Will they be from Moth Gideon? Or maybe there's not others, and the other thing is, is that they will start um, searching for more. But I have a sneaky suspicion that there is going to be others. Let me know what you think in the comments below.